morning, friends. Good morning, everyone. I am just waking up. It is my last full day with my cast. I'm <clears throat> so I started watching quite a bit of YouTube videos um, to see what it's like for people when they get on their boot. And I think I'm still going to have my crutches. Like, I just really, really think that I'm still going to have my crutches after I get my boot tomorrow. So I don't want to say it's my last day in crutches, but it's my last day with my cast. So that's exciting. <laughs> All right. Um, let me bring you guys around today. <clears throat> see what I end up doing. I'm going to get up. I'm going to wash my face, brush my teeth. Uh, and then probably honestly just come back to bed and watch TV or something. Okay guys, so when I'm usually standing and doing something like on a counter or just like brushing my teeth and stuff, I try to like set, set my crutches down because I feel like if I'm like leaning over and I'm leaning on my crutches, um, I've sometimes like like kind of stumbled like where I'm like leaning and then it, they just kind of go, I don't know, side to side um, or front. So I usually just rest my the crutch that I have my good leg on, I'll rest this one. Um, <clears throat> because I'm pretty comfortable, I'm gonna go ahead and rest both crutches. And then just get going with whatever I have to do. And then I lean on the counter for support if needed. So yeah, that's kind of how comfortable I've gotten. So let me put my hair up. little brush that I usually wash my face with but it's in the shower and I only had sunscreen and eye cream on so it's not like I had makeup on or I need to scrub the crap out of my face all right I'm gonna put on some sunscreen again moisturizer eye cream and then we'll go downstairs okay so let's go downstairs I'm gonna make some coffee, come back upstairs, and keep watching TV because <laughs> there's not much to do. Um, It's better over time, I promise. Um, my biggest advice is that when you're walking down the stairs, I should not be doing this, but here I am. I should not be going backwards is what I mean. But when you guys are going down the stairs, put your leg in the front, um, because if you put it in behind you, the stairs will they'll hit it. And not only that, but if you feel like you're falling forward, you're really gonna like just fall because your leg's behind you. So. <clears throat> When you're going down the stairs, bring your foot forward. And then going up the stairs, you want to just put your leg behind you, which you guys will see when I go upstairs after my coffee's done. <laughs> Another thing with crutches that I learned is that you should not rest your pits like directly on here. Like you should not be walking around like this. Like th you should not be like this. Like if anything, these should kind of just support like underneath your pit. So I literally have mine like my pits up here. I rest them like an inch below and then I just kind of like really put all my force down here and like support because then your pits will really start to hurt. So that's something I learned too. I don't rest my crutches directly on my pits. I literally just like use it as support and rest it all down here. This is where I put all of my like strength. It goes on there. Okay, I'm like extra tired right now because carrying around my camera and trying to vlog at the same time is just extra tiring. Um, but because we usually, we normally make coffee here, I have like, we have like a little setup on this side. Um, I'm actually gonna make a different type of coffee today because my friend gave me this little packet, which I'll show you guys. Um, 
but yeah, I'm gonna try a little different. I usually just use the Costco coffee. Um, we brew it here and we just add milk. I usually add half and half and some little sweetener, so. Just gonna heat up some water. Okay, you guys are probably wondering how I did that. It's not safe and I don't like suggest anyone does it, but I found a way to kind of move my, like if I'm carrying something, I found a way to like move my crutch. Don't do it. But if I'm like just literally going from like one side of the kitchen to the other where there's counters, I will do it, but don't do it. <laughs> okay, so grab my coffee. Some here. Okay, so this is what it looks like if you guys are wondering. It's Vietnamese coffee, um, and it comes with its own, like, filter, which is kind of cool. So it says to open up the filter, so it comes like that. So open up the filter, and then you open this, and then you literally just pour this. Freaking cool, you guys. Milk out. And the sweetener. Okay, so since there's no one home right now, um, I'm going to have to carry the coffee upstairs. So it's in a mason jar and I put the lid on it. And honestly, what I think I'm just going to do is I'm just going to like carry it like, so I'm probably just going to do something like this where I can still hold my crutch, but I'm holding my coffee too and just go up that way. Okay guys, so I made it safely to my room. I am here with my coffee. My coffee's safe. I didn't drop it or spill it. It's sitting right there. Um, so yeah, I'm going to watch TV. I'm probably going to just hang out. I'm probably gonna watch like an episode and then I might make my way downstairs so I can get some food again. Well, not again, but just make my way downstairs again so I can get something to eat. So I'll take you guys with me then. If you guys are wondering what I'm watching on Netflix right now, I literally just started this this morning when I woke up. And it's pretty interesting. It's called Sweet Tooth. And it's basically about how this virus, coronavirus, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, but it's basically about how this virus takes over like human population and kills a lot of people. And this new type of species is born, which is called a hybrid. So they're like half human, like half deer or half skunk or half, just like half animal, half um certain types of animals um but yeah it's on netflix it's called sweet tooth the first episode was, wasn't too bad it actually like caught my attention and i think it's the little boy that's like that's gonna be a main character i think it's it's him you just kind of like you're like oh you kind of get tied to him so i'm about to watch the second episode so we'll see we'll see how it goes but um if you guys are wondering that's what i'm watching based off the first episode i would recommend it but i don't know what these next episodes will be like but we'll be like but so far off the first episode, I would recommend to watch if you're not watching anything right now. So Leslie just FaceTimed me. Um, usually she makes food for us. <laughs> I feel so bad because I can't like, I can't really give back what I'm getting right now from people. And like Leslie's been such, such a huge support because she's like the one that's always home. Let's look here. But yeah, so anyways, um, Leslie FaceTimed me and she was like, hey, have you ate? And I was like, no, I was literally about to go downstairs to start to see what I could make. She said they're going out to eat. So, well, at first they were going to order food and then they decided they were going to 
just eat at the place instead. So I'm going to go with her. Um, so I'll see you guys there. I'll show you guys how I work around getting inside a car, how I work getting outside of a car. It's actually not that hard. Um, I've gotten it down. It's, it's hard when you're on high vehicles. So if you have to get on a high truck, um, it, that's when it gets hard because you literally have to like hop on. But if it's like a smaller car, then it's not much of a, not much of a hassle. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys, uh, at breakfast. All right. So since I'm getting ready to go get some food, um, I am prepping my backpack. I usually carry a backpack with me or I'll carry like that black purse right there. Um, and I highly, 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 highly recommend having like a purse or a backpack or something that you can put stuff in when you're going out because it just makes carrying everything so much more easier. So definitely recommend guy or girl carry a backpack. Has food defeated us? <laughs> He's like, uh-uh. <laughs> Damn, bro. Look at that Thank service. You. For real? <laughs> VIP. Love it. Toodaloo. Okay, guys. We're back home. I'm gonna chill. Watch more TV. Watch more of this Sweet Tooth series. Feed me some tigers. What did you say? Day in the life of adoration. <laughs> Her boyfriend comes and brings her her tacos, you know, you gotta get them without cebolla. Mmm, yum. No cebolla, that's a must for her. <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and close out today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed what I shared with you guys today. I know I didn't, I wasn't doing a whole lot, but that's just really kind of how my days go. And when I am doing stuff, that's kind of how I'm in and out of the house. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, we are on our last adventure of the night, or I would say just adventure of the day. Um, we are, we stopped at the store, we're getting some bread and then we are going to stop at Dutch and get some hot chocolate and then call it a night. I hope you guys have a good night. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you made it this far. Thank you guys. Bye.